Shalom, God bless you, God bless you, hallelujah. Praise God, praise God. Do you know God is a shepherd? Is Jehovah Ra means my shepherd. I thank the Lord for you, hallelujah. God is so faithful, he is our shepherd. Listen to what the Bible says. That the Lord is my shepherd, I shall not want. You know when you have a shepherd, when a sheep has a shepherd, the sheep are safe. They are fed well. The shepherd knows where there is a lush pasture for the sheep. So God is our shepherd, Jehovah Ra. The Bible says he make me to lie down in green pasture. God knows what is good for you. He says in his word that he shall not deny us any good thing. He provides all our needs according to the glorious riches in Christ Jesus. This world, you must submit to the Lord as a shepherd because we are living in a world full of turmoil, a world full of hopelessness. But when the Lord is your shepherd, you are safe. He says, hallelujah, he restore my, restores my soul. He leads me in the path of righteousness for his name's sake. He knows where there is righteousness for you. When you read his word, he guides you by the Spirit of God to be able to understand his precepts so that you may be able to walk in them. The laws of God are not burdensome. Praise the name of the Lord. Hallelujah. So the Lord by his Spirit, he guides us in all truth. He teaches us all things. So he leads us into the path of righteousness for his name's sake. The Bible continues to say, yeah, though, though I walk through the valley of the shadow of death, I shall fear no evil. In the current world, where there is a lot of things that are causing men to fear, when the Lord is your shepherd, I want to assure you, even if you walk in the valley of the shadow of death, you shall fear no evil. Because a shepherd is with you. The Lord says, I will not forsake you. I will not leave you. God is always with us. He dwells in us. He lives in us. We must know how to remain in the shelter of the Most High God. The Bible says in verse in Psalms 91, He who dwells in the sacred place of the Most High God shall abide under the shadow of the Almighty. I mean, mind to dwell with the shepherd. Praise the name of Jesus. He says that, uh, Aha! His rod and his staff, they comfort me. His rod will comfort you. In every affliction, the Lord's comfort shall be your portion in the name of Jesus Christ. He says that he will prepare for us a table before us in the presence of our enemies. Is the lifter of our heads. You want to lift your head. You want to lift your head. Not to be oppressed, not to be suppressed, because the Lord, by his mighty hand of power, he shall give you victory in every situation. When you commit your life to him and you acknowledge him as your shepherd, the Jehovah Ra, he shall keep you by his mighty, powerful hand and his countenance shall preserve you. Hallelujah. He says, you prepare for me a table before me in the presence of my enemies. Hallelujah. And he says, you anoint my head with oil. Praise the name of the Lord. The Lord gives you ability. The Spirit of the Lord is a divine ability. Praise the name of Jesus Christ. And he says that his cup, I mean, it, 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 my cup runs over the abundance of the grace. Praise the name of Jesus. Because of the anointing the Lord is putting upon your head to strengthen you. Anointing strengthens. Acts chapter 1 verse 8. It says you shall receive power when the Holy Ghost comes upon you. No one does not require power. Power brings influence. When you have the power of the Holy Ghost, you have the influence in the spirit world. And you influence the natural world. Why? Because you have the supernatural power power. Ha! Praise the name of Jesus Christ. He says, surely goodness and mercy shall follow you. When you make the Lord your shepherd, Jehovah Ra, hey, surely goodness and mercy shall follow you all the days of your life, and you shall dwell in the house of the Lord forever. Praise the name of Jesus Christ. Father, I thank you. Bless your people. As your Jehovah Ra, you guide us, you lead us, Lord, in your ways everlasting. Thank you, Holy Spirit, for being our guide and our teacher. We thank you. We bless you in Jesus' mighty name. God bless you. God lift you. God watch over you in Jesus Christ's mighty name. Amen. 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 Shalom.